Hello, 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 everyone. How you guys doing? How you guys doing? Hello, Crimson. Hello, Gaiden. Hello, Matt. Hello, Olive. How you guys doing? How you guys doing? All right. Yes, the uh, <laughs> the Splatoon 3 release date has officially been announced. How you guys feeling? Hi, Azriel. Hi, Azriel. Um. Yeah, how are you guys feeling? Hi, Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Doing amazing. K gal, yes. I, I like the K gal. I feel hyped, right? Right? Loki cam? Yes, you're getting the face cam today because today it is. Why am I so far over? I don't know. Today is Five Nights at Freddy's Day. And yeah, so what we're gonna do is like do an hour of just turfing around turf wars, and then we're gonna and then we're gonna do some Five Nights at Freddy's because I can only be live for two hours tonight because I have to I actually have to go to bed really early tonight because of um work. Yeah, it's only gonna be uh two hours. An official poll: How quickly will locally say something? They will respond to, don't quote me on that, 30 minutes, 2 hours, 1 hour, oh gosh. Hi botanist, how you doing? Yay FNAF Fridays, I'm going to hope that I can get to night 5 tonight, I think we're on night 4 right now. If so, I'm going to try my best to beat both nights tonight, but we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, I'm just going to do turf today. It also has to do with the fact that I am exhausted, I'm... <laughs> You guys can't tell I'm actually not even wearing makeup right now because I was too damn tired to put it on. I don't even have lipstick on. Not even lipstick. Like, yeah, today was a rough day. I exhausted. I'm stiff. I actually low-key keep forgetting that Botanist's real name is Steph. Because in my mind, Botanist is just Botanist, right? Because my real name isn't Loki. And nobody knows my real name. But yeah, so I keep thinking botanist is just botanist. Oh, occasionally, occasionally. Usually when I have the face cam on, I have like eyeliner, not eyeliner, I um eyeshadow on, blush on. Um I typically have lipstick on at the very least. I just I'm exhausted today, so you're getting tired, Loki. You're getting tired, Loki. Nice, as real nice. Damn it, Bonus. Why do you gotta dox me like that? Bonus, now I have to report you to the meanie police, because you're being mean. Or I can die. Yeah, surprisingly, this is my no makeup look, by the way. KGL is killing me right now. KGL, I'm not doing with the KGL right now. Oh, by the way, can somebody give a shout out to uh, Mr. Cool? Mr. Botanist Cool? One of the mods give a shout out to Botanist Cool because Botanist is indeed very cool and Botanist has been very nice to us. So, yeah. Thank you, Michelle. Seriously, if you have not checked out Botanist already, Botanist is indeed very cool. You should go check him out. I didn't know it was without makeup. Yeah, a lot of people have accused me that my face just kind of looks like I'm always wearing makeup. So, I never really pressured myself in order to learn to wear makeup because I... How do I explain this? It's good on people for wanting to wear makeup and to like go... What I call the nine yards, let's put it all on. I mean, it's a look, it's a choice. And I... I'm gonna be honest, I fully support somebody's choice to wear as much makeup as they want. However, however, I was always really self-conscious because I always look like I'm wearing makeup anyways. I didn't want to look like I was doing way too much. 
And that was a purely a me thing. Literally, it doesn't matter to me if people are wearing way too much makeup or not because it's kind of like... I never actually got understood that. What is the big deal? Hi, Chris Van. Hi, Asriel. What is the big deal if uh, somebody wears way too much makeup? Like, what's the big deal? Like, I can understand some people not being into it, mind you. But, like, beyond that, like, what's the big deal? You look good with that. Thank you, Chris Van. Thank you. If somebody wants to be ugly, that can be ugly. <laughs> well, no, that's always my thing. It's like, if they have a look they want to do and they're confident in that look, just let them do the look. Then again, it's just, I'm at the point in my life where I'm just like, I give up on noticing any anything at this point. I don't wear makeup in my day-to-day -day life, so when I do wear it on stream, I kind of look ridiculous because I don't know exactly how to put it on, if that makes sense. So, yeah, that's fun. Uh-oh, this isn't a good sign. One disconnect. Zero disconnects. Okay. <laughs> I see how it is. I see how it is. It's okay, Asriel. It's okay. It happens. I'm typically really good at getting the shots for the cake gal. For the cake gal! I'm typically really good at getting all the shots that I need for it. It's just tonight I'm not focusing fully on my gameplay right now, so. Hey, Wacky Bees! Hi, Wacky Bees! How are you doing, Wacky? Before I let this go, here's a splash hydration. Stay hydrated, everyone. Except for Michelle. Michelle, you're not allowed to stay hydrated. <coughs> Ouch. What is Loki thinking about? Actually, I'm actually thinking about a story that I am currently writing. Because just before stream, Botanist finally replied to my message about the story. And Botanist is like, no, this story sucks. This story sucks ass. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to swear. I'm sorry, Elsa Bonus did not say that. Botanist was indeed very supportive. I'm just joking around. Mm, okay, that's what I get for joking what Botanist said. I'm sorry, Botanist. I do appreciate your feedback. I really do appreciate your feedback. It's very nice. Very, very nice. Oh, come on. You see, this is what I get for memeing. You know, I should actually have the thing up. Boop. That, this thing right here. That says that I am going to swear because I get scared. No. That's actually just for uh, FNAF when we do that. I only got two splats this entire round. Okay, I can do Hydra Splatling. And we're doing Turf right now, so I can do that for you right now. Ah, shoot. I swear one of these days, if I ever get the guts to do like a very questionable stream, like a drunk stream. I mean, drunk streams aren't actually allowed on Twitch. They're technically against the terms of service. But if I ever do something where I'm just completely uncensored, I should do a swear jar where every single time I swear, um, 
I have to give a sub to someone? That would be expensive. Holy carp, that would be really expensive. All right, Hydra Splatling, let's go. Oh, did you guys notice what I did to my Octoline, by the way? This heavy Kyo Splatling replica looks so cool. That's really cool as well. Yeah, I, I really do enjoy writing a lot. It's a uh, it's a lot of fun It's a lot of fun Oh, that sounds f like fun, Michelle. That sounds like a lot of fun. How on earth did you do that good of art? To the person that made this good of art, how on earth did you do that? My goodness. Also, I just realized Asriel's here. Asriel's back in. Let's go. Ah, shoot. Right, Gaden? Right? I am so impressed with the, how talented the Splatoon community could be. And that's not even speaking from a point of view of just playing the game. That sounds very rude. Okay, there's a lot of people that are really good at playing the game. But there's also a lot of people who are really good at drawing in the game. A lot of artistic people. A lot of people who have some really creative ideas. A lot of people who have a lot of fun with this. I did that wrong. I just think Splatoon community is so cool. Name a coolest community than Splatoon community you can't. Shoot! The me community? Oh, are you seeing the Octa family that gathers here on the twitch.tv slash Loki underscore the underscore Octo is a lot better than the uh, Splatoon community? I agree, Michelle. I agree. Know the Michelle fan club? Uh, that makes a lot more sense, honestly. Oh gosh. Yeah, I'm trying to hold the line. Ah, shoot. GG quest. GG, GG. It's composed of mainly dots. That would make sense. I mean, that would make sense since uh, that's kind of how you get the textured look and all that kind of stuff. It is still really impressive. Like, you still need to have a really good technique and really good fluent motions in order to do it. GG's, GG's. GG's, everyone. Right? Right, Gaiden? Right? Aren't we all made of tiny little dots, though? Mother of God! You're right! I want to say a bad word. I want to say a bad word because I'm slightly mad I have to do this weapon again.
Yeah, let's go out live! Let's go! Hi, Mackenzie's! How you doing? How you doing, friend? You've been... It's been a while since you've been here. How you doing? Ah, uh, nice, Asriel. Nice. I want one of my friends to get Splatoon 2. Which, by the way, that friend actually does watch my uh, stream. Which, if you're watching this, get Splatoon 2, you idiot. JK, I love you. But they said they don't want to get Splatoon 2 because Splatoon 3 is so close. But I'm like, just get Splatoon 2. There's a lot of fun you can have in Splatoon 2. Yeah, you thought you did something. Then Chris Ren did something. Uh, Mackenzie, we're not doing private battles right now. We're doing public battles. So you can just jump on in. A3 and all of those will do. What one? What bad word was I gonna say? I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. I'm too innocent and pure to say a bad word. Haven't you heard that I'm an angel? Oh, come on, Michelle. What is one crap thing I have said in this stream? Or in my entire time streaming. You can't name anything that I've said bad. Okay, besides that. Besides that little mix up. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, besides that. Oh, right, I'm going to switch the weapon up after this. Let's see what is next in the uh, weapon request. The HD Nozzle Nose. That should be fun. Ouch! Yeah, that was my bad. When did I do that? <laughs> But, you know what, I could believe that I did that by accident, because it seems like I would say the F word, and then I'd be like, oh, e oh, uh, another bad word, I said bad word, oh, I did again. Uh, H3 Nozzle Nose, let's go. H3 Nozzle Nose, let's see if I can find my nose. There's my nose. <laughs> that you said you've tried to avoid bad words and you said it anyways. I don't have an excuse for that. I I don't have an excuse for that. I that's my brain being dead. Have you heard the new trend of brain of being brain dead? Being brain dead is a lovely experience. I highly recommend you should try it. Yes, Rocky Vays. I, I saw them. I saw them. You know, Michelle. I'm honestly surprised you didn't pull up anything from the uh, close channel. Hi, Dank Beans. How you doing? 
How you doing, Dake memes? Ice Grip Boy! Ouch. How you doing, Squid Boy? Tired just got for a dude same! I'm tired as fuck! <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say that. I didn't mean to swear, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm tired as carp. There you go. I'm tired as carp. Oh my god. <laughs> nothing, Michelle. Nothing. I didn't do anything bad. I was just telling Dake memes how I was tired. Loki, I don't believe you should. I am a very truthful person. No, but seriously, if you do want to know, I uh, Dake memes was talking about how they were tired because they just got off work. And I said I was tired AF, but I said uh, the F word. And I said it really loudly. Congratulations! Rocky Vase, thanks so much for one bit! Very much appreciate, very much appreciate indeed. Corn! Yes, we love corn! And like the actual type of corn, not 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 the other type of corn. We like real corn. Yeah, hi, Smith McKenzie. I hope you are enjoying the stream and welcome back, my friend. Welcome back. Well, I mean, that's what you do when you're expressing how tired you are. You put emphasis on the wrong words. That worked. Do you guys want to hear a story about uh, someone thinking I'm innocent? Do you guys want to hear a story of somebody thinking I'm very innocent? Back when I was in high school, high school, um, one of my friends says, you're very innocent and you're very sweet and it's like you can't harm anyone. And you want to know what I did in response to that? Did someone saying that they thought that I was very innocent and very sweet and I wouldn't harm a fly? I slapped them. To this day, I'm not sure why my reaction to that was slapping them. I didn't slap them in the face, mind you. I slapped them in the shoulder. But I still slapped them and walked away. <laughs> I told you guys I'm awkward in social situations. Hey, we got gone here too. Nice. The holiday response? Oh, but I had a large group of friends believe that I was, uh, quite innocent. Another reaction I had to someone saying that I'm innocent was, um... I can't say that on stream now that I say about it. Okay, so different reaction to, uh... Somebody calling me innocent was me... Uh, talking about an erotic fan fiction that I read. There you go, I can say that. The we back in the mines. I was quite nice, clearly in class. I didn't do anything. Bad people thought I was too angel. Then 
In music class, we were having a quiz, and everyone was, for, was being forking stupid. Yeah, faster, puzzle. <laughs> Ooh, nice, Michelle. I may be small, but I crave violence. I'm actually not that small. I seem small in this thing, but I'm not that small. Sometimes I baby, sometimes I not. Sometimes I bite. Actually, I do have a ha habit of biting people. I should really stop. I really do like biting people, though. Hi, man, monkey! How you doing, man, monkey? I am so sorry if you're new to the streaming. Your first uh, introduction to me was I like biting people. I, I swear that's not a normal thing for me to say or to confess to. Well, you know what it is. You know what they say. Tall people are peaceful because they're closer to heaven. Troy people are angry because they're closer to hell. I'm sorry. That's like really mean to say. I'm sorry. I'm doing good out of you. I'm tired. But I'm enjoying life. I'm enjoying life. I had kind of like a really busy day at work. Uh, which was fun. But at the same time, I'm only going to be able to stream for like two hours tonight because the fact is I need to go bed early so I can go up and get up from work again tomorrow. I had an idea that I want to put forth for content, but I don't know if I should. Do you guys ever get that way? Where you think to yourself, I should do this thing for content, but I, I don't know if I should. Can't confirm my small friend on violence and the trolls. <laughs> she tired of anything? <laughs> what, did, what on earth did you think I said, Michelle? What on earth did you think? Vor? Why would I make Vor? Why on earth would I make Vor? Can you make Vor in real life? I am so sorry if, uh, if this is your first stream here. I am very sorry. I don't know what you said, but do it. Bonus wants me to make Vor. But it's confirmed. Bonus wants me to make Vor. <coughs> All right, Explosher. What are we talking about? I don't know. I don't know. Michelle wants to talk about Vor for every reason. Hey, Loki, no, you can't. What do you mean I can't do that? You were the one that brought it up! <laughs> How am I twisting this situation? You were the one that bought, bought it up! Anyways, going back to what I was talking about, I have this idea for new content that I want to make, but I don't know if I should go for it. What the fluff did I jump into? Because the big of Calamity strikes a shout out. Because Calamity is a very good being. Does not know what Vor is. So give Calamity a shout out. Calamity is returning to content eventually. So give Calamity a shout out. Yeah. How you doing, Calamity? I'm trying to talk about my idea for new content that I want to make. But nobody's letting me. I don't want to talk about Vor anymore. Unless we're talking about Kirby. Then I'll talk about Vor. But I want to talk about content. Let's talk about... Oh, I know what... How do you know what Vor is? Okay, maybe I don't want to know. You alright? Get the air, Calamity. Get the air. Anyways. I have a new idea for content. Uh, I don't know if I should say what my new idea is, because, I don't know. I'm dying. 
That's my idea for new content. It's death. No, it's not. I'm just joking. I'm. I do not advocate for death. Now I say it. No, Michelle. No. Bad, Michelle. Bad. Loki doesn't know Google exists. I know it exists, but like how, why, how, how do you get to the point of your life where you're looking that up? Hi, Blaze Fighter. How you doing? How you doing? But no, this content idea would be for the YouTube channel, which I know people are going to roll their eyes to because I never finished the Deltarune Let's Play. Here's the thing. I finished recording Deltarune last year. I finished recording all the episodes for Deltarune last year. I just never posted them. So, yeah. Enjoy that picture in your head for a moment. But yeah, I have an idea for new content I want to do for YouTube, along with uh, other Let's Plays that I'm working on. I want to do like a, um, not a review type thing, but like a Let's Play mixed in with a review of just really old games that I used to play when I was a kid. And going back to them now and see if they still hold up or if they don't really hold up as well as I remember them holding up. I don't know if that would be something anyone's interested in. It would just be me talking about a lot of memories and how I remember the game compared to how they actually are. I think that's what I've been... Ba no, Michelle! Bad Michelle. Bad. Bad Michelle. Can I put Michelle in the timeout corner without demodding Michelle? Michelle, that isn't legal! <laughs> Sorry, I'm still coughing. I'm still coughing. But it seems like most people would be interested in it. I don't know how exactly... I don't want to use that weapon. I don't know exactly how... Um... I would go about doing it, but I do really want to do it. Yo, Mod Michelle, darn it! Yes, I have seen the Splatoon 3 release date. It is, I think, September 9th. Why do you apologize for coughing? Because I know how annoying it can get, and... Whenever I start getting into coughing fits, they last for a long time, so I just get into Hobbit of the Hobbit. I get into a Hobbit. <laughs> Apparently I'm inside a Hobbit now. Don't put that onto the coach channel. Please don't quote me on that. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> no, no, no. I get into the habit. Not the hobbit. The habit of um, apologizing for coughing. I'm sorry for copying. I'm so sorry for wherever the hack is going on here. Uh, 
Let's go. But yes, that's why I apologize for coughing because when cough lasts for as long as I as they do for me. Um They end up being really it ends up being really annoying if you don't at least acknowledge that it's annoying. Oh, that's really cool, Blaze Fighter. That's really cool. I never actually played Sword on Art Online. I probably should. It seems like it would be a killer VR game. Out. Yeah, I low key deserve that. Alright, let's go, let's go. Grim range, alright. How cool would be if Splatoon got a movie? It would be really cool. It would be really cool. I just hope it wouldn't be like the Mario movie. That's all I ask. Don't do anything like the Mario movie. I thought it was just an anime. I did too, but I know there was. I know. I knew there was a game. I just didn't realize how old it was. How old is Sword Art? Is Sword Art Online as an IP? I wonder now. Or if it's just 10 years old. Okay, GG, GG. Splatoon show would be cool. It would really depend on how they would do it. Like, I don't think a live action Splatoon show would work, but maybe like an animated show? As long as they don't animate that one new dude. I don't know how that worked. Me too, me too. Why not? Because the, these kids are supposed to be what? 12? 13? It, it, it's a little bit weird that they even put that into the manga. It's very weird that they put that into the manga. I don't know the dude's name. Uh, Michelle would... Michelle would probably know better than me. It's the only panel I've ever seen of the Splatoon manga. But there's this guy that just, uh, for some weird reason, takes off his pants. I don't know why. You want to match my point and do pants down? Oh. That's the context. He's done it twice? Excuse me? Excuse me? What? Why? Why, Goggles? Why you be so weird? How? How do you do that? I died. I'm wondering how art is done and then I die. Sounds like life.
Nice, nice, GG, Squid Boy, GG. Four, three, two, one, shoot. Actually, I think we won, so we might be fine. Yeah, we definitely won. We definitely won. But why, though? That's my only question. Why, though? The 14? That really, that really doesn't help anyone's case there. That really doesn't help anyone's case. Uh, what was the next weapon? I think it was Kenza Rapid. I don't know why I wanted to say something very inappropriate there. I wanted to say something extremely inappropriate there. Why am I just in the mood to say inappropriate things today? I don't know. Dude, Splatoon is so weird. I thought Splatoon Lords Freaky Goggles is a completely different story, right? They do have some good ideas going in the Splatoon manga, but if they were to adapt it to any other form of media, they would need to change it a lot. The weirdest thing, though, is that in the Canadian version of the manga, they didn't edit out the one nude scene. It's there, and the manga is in the kids section. So I'm like, how did that get past Western... Like, fact, not fact trackers, but like age trackers tr or something like that. I keep getting sniped. I want to read this Splatoon manga, but I just haven't had time to do it. Really, Michelle? Really? Wow, that is some thick, dark plot armor. I, I, I shouldn't say that. I shouldn't say that. Don't worry, Gaiden. Don't worry. You're having fun. Alright, I will remind you guys that we're in 15 minutes. We are switching over to Five Nights at Freddy's. Again, that's Five Nights at Frederick's. Uh, we're playing through the first game. We're on night four, I want to say. Uh, I think night four. Um, we're gonna go get try and get through at least one night. One night. Yep, it's Friday, so it's FNAF night. Honestly, even though we've only been doing one night per game, or one one night per stream, or per Friday, 
I am very pleased with our pacing because I thought the first game was going to take me a lot longer due to the fact that I'm a chicken shit. Oh. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. I'm not going to end the stream over that. I'm not going to end the stream. I, I don't know why I'm swearing so much. I am tired. That's probably why I didn't sleep well last night and I am going on like... I don't know, 16 hours without sleep? I don't know. Oh my gosh. Wow, okay, wow. Here's the worst thing. Because of the fact that we're playing Five Nights at Freddy's, I'm probably going to swear a lot more. Because of the fact that it's going to scare me. I have a tendency to swear when I'm scared. I swore it and didn't realize it. When I was playing up yet, looking at... I just won like what three times? Yeah, that's that that's how you know that FNAF is getting to me. Play FNAF 4? Uh Crimson, if you haven't been here in a while, I should probably catch you up. We're actually playing through every single FNAF game that I own. I think the only exception to the rule is FNAF VR at the moment. Because I don't have a VR headset that will let me stream. I didn't want to buy it expecting to be able to stream it and not being able to stream it. So besides that one game and the uh, discontinued game, we're going to be playing through every single one of them. We're going to be playing through every single one of them um, all the way up to Security Breach. I know, that's also why I don't want to play VR, uh, FNAF VR, because, uh, I am way too scared to, like, actually interact with those, uh, boxy animatronics. <sighs> that, I'm, I'm sorry, that sounded wrong, saying that out loud, but I was thinking of, like, the foxy part of the... Whole, uh, I, I should really just shut up for the rest of the stream. Here's the thing. I don't know the strategy for the last two nights on FNAF 1. Um, from what people have told me last time, from what I've been able to remember, it's only check lights and check, um, Foxy, but that's all I can remember. Hi, Alex Lever. How you doing? How you doing? In FNAF VR? Yeah, I bet. Although, fun fact, Foxy and Mangled are probably my two favorite animatronics. I don't know why I like the two of them. I like the two of them a lot. Mangle's funky. Mangle's cute. Mangle can strangle me any day of the week. I don't know why I followed through with saying that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I I thought it would be funny. <laughs> oh my gosh. I... Please don't quote me on that one. Please don't quote me on that one. I mean, I can see how you think he would be Fun Time Foxy. Or they would be Fun Time Foxy. Excuse me, please repeat. No, I'm not repeating anything. Alright, last round. I'll do E-Leader. I'll do E-Leader. E-Leader scope. 
I said I really like Mangle, and Mangle can strangle me anytime, if anyone's curious why I said. I wish I could be good with the charger. It seems like the bow works like a bamboozler. More than... What the heck? More than a uh, anything else. Which again... Which again... Um, I'm not very surprised of. But it really makes me doubt that uh, the bow is going to be the first weapon that anyone gets. I highly doubt that the both going to be the first weapon that they give you. Yeah, Gaiden, it would have been really cool if we could go E-Leader versus E-Leader. But unfortunately not. You know what? My main goal for this round is going to be not dying. I am going to try and not die. Okay, I died. GG, squid boy. GG, GG. I do need to get better at surviving in this game. Like, a lot better at surviving in this game. I suck at surviving in this game. Which one was FNAF 2? Oh, was FNAF 2 the one with the mask? The one where you have to put on the, uh, mask? There, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay, I can understand why you would think that one's the freakiest. I think the one that I'm dreading the most was FNAF 4 and FNAF uh, Ultimate Custom Night because we are going to be doing some of Ultimate Custom Night. We are going to be doing some of, uh, of Ultimate Custom Night. Um, but yeah. Yeah, that's the thing that makes me the most nervous for FNAF 4 is that they expect you to have really high volume uh, They expect you to make your volume really high But I don't know if I'll be able to physically do that because of sensory issues and I don't know how you get around that as someone who has a sensory issue with uh, with audio sensory so I don't know if we're actually going to complete FNAF 4 or I'm going to have to skip it after the first few nights. Hi, Moldo Scorpion. Yes, it is Loki the Octo, although we're switching over to FNAF now. All right, here's what we're going to do now. <laughs> I have a feeling that was a late April's full joke. What was a late April's full joke? All right, one, one. FNAF 4? I don't know. I don't know.
all of the FNAF games after one kind of feel like a April Fool's jokes. I'm not going to lie to you. I tried playing FNAF Security Breach, but I just couldn't. Really, Gaiden? Really? Why is that? Why is that? Was it too freaky for you? To me, have the little jump scares? I don't know. I'm looking forward to uh, Security Breach because Security Breach seems like the more chilled. The more chilled FNAF game. But it also, it also depends. It also depends. Also, you like my Halloween shirt that I'm wearing? It's a little bit dirty, but it is what it is. All right, so I'm going to take a break for a moment. FNAF 1, 3SL, and UCN are the ones I like the most. Ultimate Custom Night, yeah. What is SL? What the heck is FNAF SL? Try to think. Oh, Sister Location. Duh. My gosh, I really need to catch up on this FNAF lore stuff. My word. My word. Anyways, I'm going to take a little bit of a break. I'm going to go get some water and stuff like that. When we come back, we'll be doing some Five Nights at Freddy's. There is no lore. I mean, like, getting to know the games itself. But yes, uh, I'll be right back. MatPat made it all a theory. I mean, yeah, that's true. Didn't, okay, here's the thing, didn't, wh while we're still talking about Five Nights at Freddy's, didn't uh, Scott Coffin, like, majorly troll MatPat before uh, he got taken off Five Nights at Freddy's? Like, I remember there was some sort of fan fiction that Scott wrote just to bug uh, MatPat and force him to read it. What, is that an actual thing? It's not a natural thing. You've got to be kidding me. That's that's kind of low-key hilarious. I mean, I feel bad for Matt, but I mean, uh, that's kind of literally his job, but still. Still. Scott does a little bit of trolling. I, yeah, yeah. I feel like his entire Five Nights at Freddy series is trolling, honestly. I really do feel like it's, the entire thing is trolling. Anyways, I'm going to take a break. I'm going to leave you guys with some music. Um, And then when we come back... I mean, to be fair, Scott kind of was forced to leave, and I mean, not that I necessarily agree with what his stances were on certain topics, but I can understand why he felt the need to leave, um, considering the actions certain fans took against him. It is sad, but it is also proof that the internet can't really leave things. Yes, I need to go get snacks. I need to go get water, actually. Uh, I'll be right back. And yeah, I'll leave you guys some music. Enjoy some tunes.
Even though the music is really, really good. Hey, hopefully not too many people left. Hey, what's up? That took me a lot longer than I thought it would. I'm so sorry for that. I am so sorry for that. You left? Understandable. I would leave too. Um. All right. I have no idea how this is going to go. But it should go interesting. go interesting see yeah, everyone's gone sorry loki oh my gosh well what night four did i change it to five nights at freddy's by the way loki new follower Savage of the Savage, thank you so much for the follow. Very much appreciated. Very much appreciated indeed. I hope you are enjoying the stream. We typically play Splatoon 2 here, so if you're interested in that, you can go put exclamation mark FC in chat. Again, that's exclamation mark FC in chat, and you'll be able to get my Nintendo Switch friend code in your whispers uh, if you want to come play with us. If not, though, completely fine. Lots of other ways to interact with the stream should you decide to do so. So, yes, welcome, welcome. Uh, you can chat in the chat, you can, um, you just follow the most that we're so lucky to have, there's so many things you can do. Alright. So what is the strategy here? What is the strategy? Is it just Light and then Foxy? I'm gonna try that one first. But I wanna get rid of this hot liquid that's in front of me. a very hot liquid that's in front of me. I don't wanna, like, accidentally bump into it. Also been following since for one year. Nice, nice. Where's my mouse? Where's my mouse? There you go. All right. The wiki has tips and strategy sections that and that's the best I can do for you. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you. This is spooky eye game. Yeah. Okay, I'm actually gonna take my one of my headphones off of one of my ears. Because I can't handle listening to it on both ears. Um, I'm very sorry if I swear or anything like that. I don't know what night four is going to be like. Um, yeah. Let's look at Foxy.
Okay, Foxy's not out yet. I'm Michelle, I can't click links right now because of how this is set up. This isn't on Scrappy, unfortunately, because Scrappy, for some weird reason, is not working fully the way that Scrappy should be working in order to catch stuff like this. So, yeah, I can't click links or else it'll take me out of the game and I don't want to do that to risk. Yeah, sorry, Michelle. I'll have to save the link for later so I can read up on to night four and five. But I have a feeling I've used up way too much energy because I'm at 81%. Yeah, where's comes to shove? Okay, is it just me or does the ambient noise get so much worse at this point? Is it just me or is that actually the case? As so if we get a blackout, I am taking off my headphones. I am not listening to Freddy Fazbear get me expectantly. Monkey, please keep it appropriate, please. Please keep your jokes at least PG. I can't tell if I'm doing good or if I'm doing really bad. I honest to goodness can't tell. What do you guys think? Do, do you guys think I'm doing good? You're good man, monkey. You're good. I just wanted to remind you to keep it all family friendly. Go away, go away. What's the percent power percentage of that? It is at 58. 57. Please go away. Please be gone. Please be gone. Wait, does Freddy not show up on the camera? Oh, shoot. Or does he not show up on here? Do I have to keep a track on him? On the cameras? Because that's not part of my plan. Oh, shoot. And that's completely... He's there. He's there. Foxy there. Yeah, I know Foxy's on the left. It's just... How do I protect myself from Freddy then? Does Freddy only show up on the left? Because last time we got killed by Freddy. Can yeah, I be honest? I can't hear Freddy's voice thing anymore. Oh, shoot. It's 3 a.m. at 38%. It's 4 a.m. and I'm at 38%. I'm not doing well. I'm going to die. When he moves room. Dude, go away. Why the heck did I agree to this? Botanist, why did you do this to me? 
botanist, why did you do this to me? Because yes, it's totally botanist's fault. Yeah, but how do I tell if he's close without looking at the, all the cameras? Because that's the thing that I want to avoid right now, is looking at all the cameras. Uh, Michelle, you might need to send that to me again after I die, because uh, I can't read that right now. 27% at 4am? What the heck? I don't know how long it's been 5 a.m. for, so I don't know if it's good or not. Yeah, but I'm wondering, does he show up in the window before he attacks you? Oh, it's good. I'm closing that door just in case. The music box is gone, so I should feel okay to open that again. Can I survive that though? I'm at 12%. Maybe that was a lot better than I thought. Oh my gosh, Freddy's gonna. But um, isn't Freddy active right away at the start though? At this point, yeah, everyone's active. No, mute the call. Mute the call. I can't handle that call. Hey, Foxy's at work. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck's oh, I do have a disclaimer saying that I am gonna swear. A disclaimer is like literally right there that I'm gonna swear every once in a while. Because this game's so damn stressful. I'm not doing night six, by the way. I am not doing night six and night seven. No way, you little fried rotisserie chicken. Which side Freddy shows up on? Does it, can anyone look up what side Freddy shows up on? And which side I need to be careful if I hear his music box come too close? Right? Okay. Like Chica? Gotcha. Thank you! He's like out there. There we go. 
I think the unfortunate thing is, is that you actually have to activate um, Foxy's animation in order to get him to go away. So, otherwise, I don't think he actually goes away. But I think as long as you don't panic and you try to find Foxy, I think there's nothing Foxy can really do to hurt you. Does that make sense? Am I making sense? I never said I was going to complete the full games. I said I was going to complete the games. I never promised the full games for this exact reason because it's it's stressful. Okay, let me see what Michelle sent me a while ago. Uh, the player can tell where Freddy is by counting how many times he's laughed or slight breathing. Are you kidding me? I have to count how many times he's laughed? Dining area, restrooms, kitchen, East Hall tall corner when freddy lasts six times that signifies that he's either moved into the office in which case his laugh will be much louder or that he's moved away from the east corner it's safe to open the door until his laugh is heard I don't know if I should give it one more shot or if I should leave it there for tonight because we're on pace for what we're typically doing. I don't know if we should give it one more shot or not. The thing is... Ah, uh, Drip, thanks so much for the splash hydration. Stay hydrated, everyone, except for Michelle. Michelle, you are not allowed to stay hydrated. So yes, this cup is quite dirty, but don't worry, it's like, it's dirty because I've been using it all day. Not like old. Take one more. The thing is, I always get scared to do more than one successful round because I get so stressed out while playing this game. But we've only been going on for what, an hour and a half? Yeah, an hour and a half in terms of live streaming. Five minutes of that was just, um... Just give me a minute, we'll give it one more shot. <coughs> give me a minute to breathe. Oh, I know nobody will be mad at anything like that. I just, I've been doing a lot of really short streams recently. And it's like, yeah. So wait. The laugh thing. Is it just how many times Freddy has laughed? Freddy Fazbear has laughed? Or is it just... Or is it any type of breathing at all that I need to be worried about? Because that doesn't seem clear to me. I want to know. I think it's just the laugh, really. Okay. Okay, so if it's just the laughs, I think I can handle that, but... The thing is, they come up so often, dude. Yeah, you're right. It's definitely more important to tell when he's in the office. All right. I'm going to give this one last shot for tonight. If we don't get this tonight, next Friday, I'm going to try this again. All right? I believe it's six, right? In the office. I'm going to mute that call because fuck that call. Again. I have it and then I I have it set so then it's like yes, I swear. Oh thank goodness you're not gonna make me sit through that damn call again. Here's the thing, I can't tell volume. I am very bad at being able to tell volume.
Holy hell, how did Markiplier do this? Okay, I think that was two laps, so I think he's somewhere else. What was that for? I can't tell if it's safe or not to open that. Okay, yeah, that's definitely one lap, so he's somewhere else. He sounds really close, but I don't know if he actually is. Open up the door. I can't tell. I can't tell. He sounds really close, but I can't tell. Yeah, I'm gonna fail this night, honestly. Oh. Okay, what I'm going to need to do is before I stream this next is to actually find the audio cues online that explain exactly what they mean. Because otherwise I'm not going to be able to know exactly when Freddy's coming. Because the fact that it's sound based, I can't deal with atmospheric sounds. At least not to the extent that it's done. This is why I don't play it fully. I can't deal with the extreme, um, like, atmosphere sounds that they use. I can't explain it. It physically bothers me to the point where I just can't do it. I'm just going to exile this game, because why not? Let's go to the screen again. Yeah, sorry, Crimson. Sorry. I can't handle, like, how much there is to that atmospheric sound. So I need to find how they actually sound so I can, like, try and memorize the one that I need. I don't know if that makes any sense. This is something I do in other games as well. It's something that I did in Splatoon when I got the Splatoon soundtracks of how to memorize, like, what's behind me and stuff like that. No, it makes sense. Good. Good.
But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I don't know who we're gonna raid today. I did not pick someone to raid today. Oh no! Oh no, I did not pick someone to raid today. And now we're in the just chatting screen. I hope you guys like this face cam thing. Um, it, it looks cool to me, but I don't know if it looks cool for you guys. Uh, who should we raid? Borat is on. <coughs> Ashton and Noun is on. Learn the RQs to detect them, yeah. I mean, that's basically what I kind of feel like I have to do. Um, Poke is on. Yeah, I'm going to raid someone who's doing, like, competitive Splatoon. But they've been going on for a really long time. I don't know if they're still going to be going on after this, but we can go say hi to them anyways. But yeah. Again, I'm really sorry, you guys, that the last run was kind of a failure. But I tried. Thank you so much for the bits. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Thank you so much for the follows. Thank you so much for playing with me tonight. Very much appreciated. Very much appreciated indeed. Um, Go say hi to Poke for me. And there you go. If you... Not donate Black Lives Matter, you can click that YouTube link or look up stream to donate on YouTube. Join the Discord if you haven't already for updates. Follow me on Twitter for updates. I also Discord to whatever your preference may be. Um didn't I show up? Oh, I just did the one thing. Okay. But yeah, there's all the other rest of it. I'm tired. I'm gonna go take a nap. And I'll hopefully see you guys tomorrow.